Hey everybody, it's Angie and welcome to Hot and Flashy. In today's video, I've got a summer kind of random clothing try on for you guys. I have been out shopping for summer clothes. I've got some bathing suits, I've got some dresses, I've got some jeans, shorts, t-shirts, just like a random mix of stuff. I wanted to be able to put this together into a lookbook, but you know, I don't really have new shoes or you know, new handbags or coordinating pieces to put with it. So I thought, let's just do a random clothing try on haul, shall we, with the stuff that I I do have. Um, we're up in a new filming space today. I've taken over the third floor of my house as a clothing filming studio. So this is working for uh, the part where I talk about the items and show them to you up close, but I don't have a space up here to show you the full outfit. So I think I'm going to have to run down the stairs, do handheld in the mirror down there, and uh, hopefully that'll work out and I won't be huffing and puffing too much during this video. So, of course, links for everything will be in the information box below the video for quick and easy shopping. I'll also include all of my sizing information, the size I took in the item, whether I think it runs small or large, if you should size down or size up, and that way you'll have a reference guide of how tall I am and how much I weigh and all that stuff to help you with sizing if you see anything that you like. So let's get started with the first outfit, which is this one. It's just a basic plain white tee with a pair of really cute cut off shorts. These are adorable. I love the fit on these. They are so comfy and I love it how they have some rips and some distressing but they also have patches in there so that it's not showing off you know the top of my thigh which I don't really want to show off anyway. So those are super cute. Really great pricing on those. I'm wearing them with my white sneakers and then over here on the top I have this adorable white t-shirt. Isn't this just such a cutie? I love this style for this year. It's a little bit of a throwback to the 90s. You know the shoulder pads are coming back in big this year and rather than doing like a puffy shoulder pad what they're doing is just kind of extending the shoulder out a little bit so it gives you a little more width up here at the top and then it helps you to taper down at the waist so it gives you a little bit more shape. I probably wear this with a baseball cap. I just love to put on a baseball cap especially in the summer. I like to give my face a little bit of protection from the sun. Of course, you know, this isn't a huge amount of protection. Something with a wider brim would obviously be better, but in a pinch, a baseball hat is great, and I love how it goes with this cute and sporty outfit. All right, here's another pair of shorts I wanted to share with you guys. I just got these in, but I tend to buy these shorts just about every year, and I love them. They're just like the perfect casual short. They're not too short. They're not too long. They're a nice lightweight like cotton chino style. They come in a few different colors, but they're just so comfortable and the fit is so perfect. So I wanted to show you these. And then the top that I have on with, I hope this top is still available, but it's like my favorite tank top of the year. I have it in uh, all three colors, black, white, and gray. And it's a really nice long t-shirt. This one's a little bit more fitted. I believe this is the extra small. I also have it in a small just so it's a little bit looser through the bodice. And then it's long enough that you can wear it with leggings or you know something like that but I like to do the front tuck with these shorts I just think it looks really really cute alrighty next outfit is one that you could wear out to lunch out to brunch just to something a little bit more dressy it features this adorable skirt I think this is so beautiful I love the fabric on this you guys may recognize this fabric from a dress that I showed you earlier in the spring that was just such a beautiful dress and the same store has it now in a cute flirty skirt. So I love this. I love the tears on it. It's a nice lightweight fluffy fabric. I got it with the same t-shirt I just had on a minute ago to show you how you can mix and match this t-shirt with lots of different things. And I switched from the baseball hat into my favorite fedora. This hat is just awesome. I love it. On the bottom, I've got on my favorite big chunky black sandals with a strap. These are so comfortable because it lifts the front of your foot up so that even though it has a heel it's not like you're walking on an angle and they're just super comfortable super great shoes I just love this whole outfit I think it's fun I think it's flirty and I think it's just perfect for summer and I just wanted to swap out the white top for a dressier black top with the skirt to show you what this looks like so that you could wear it you know to a little bit more of a dressy occasion but I love this top I love the skirt with black or white I think it goes great with both uh, this top is one of my favorites. I wear it year in, year out. I've had it for a few years. What I love about it is that it's a like a tank top, but it's got this lace overlay on top of the straps, and so you can wear a regular bra with it. And that is just the best thing. 
I don't know about you, but I hate wearing a strapless bra, and so anytime that I can like cheat the system and get something that looks like you would have to wear a strapless bra with it, but you don't, it is a win-win. So anyway, I love this little tank top. I'll link it below the video as well, and I love it with the skirt. It's just one of those things that you keep in your closet. You can wear it for business. If you put a jacket on over it, you can wear it out to lunch for date night. I mean, it's just so versatile. It's the one thing that I like always take it with me when I travel because I always know that I'm going to have a use for it just to put on under something else but I think it makes a really cute outfit with this little leopard skirt for summer. All right you guys next up is this beautiful blouse. I just love this. I actually bought this like in February and have been waiting for summer to wear it but it's so pretty and it just screams summer. The fabric is so soft feels so great it's so lightweight but look at the lace detail on the sleeve and then it's got the inset here on the shoulders it's pretty low cut top so I'm wearing just a little tank on underneath it's got these sweet little buttons down the front and the fabric is just so flowy and lightweight it feels like really good quality cotton or linen and then let me show you the back because the back is all lace so definitely, I kind of like the tank top underneath. If you wore a nude bra, you could definitely get away with it, but isn't it just so beautiful? And I love the drape on it, how floaty it is. I have the half tuck done here to wear it with jeans. Of course, the skinny jeans are out, so for this summer, wide leg jeans are more in. A little bit of crop wide leg is what I have on with this, and I really like these jeans. They're one of my favorite pairs that I got this year, so I'll link them below. And the jeans just fit so well, and they're so comfortable. The denim isn't too heavy. It doesn't have a ton of stretch to it. Okay, so it took a little do in, but I had to shop my closet to find jeans that I really liked with this top. These look like skinny jeans from the top, but they're not. They're these flare jeans that I got last summer, so kind of shop my closet on this one. If you're someone who doesn't want to show your upper arms, this is perfect little cover, but it's not going to make you feel hot. These are the platform shoes that I'm wearing with most of the outfits. I love these. I've this is my second pair, um, so I've been wearing these for like three or four years. They are still in style and they're so comfortable. I got the taupe suede, they go with everything. They go with shorts, they go with jeans, they go with skirts, they go with dresses. All right, I bought this next dress thinking that it might make a super cute beach cover-up, but for me it's a little bit too long for a beach cover-up, but I love it as a dress, just a casual, like kicking around every day kind of dress to go run your errands. It's not going to be too short that you're going to be, you know, worried about the wind blowing your skirt up or anything. It actually hits right at the knee, at least on me, so if you're shorter than me it's going to be longer, more like a midi dress, and if you're taller than me it could be just a knee grazing dress, but it's so lightweight and comfortable and fluid and I love these arms. They have a little split here and then they hang. And I really love the fabric. It's really cute and charming. This one comes in a lot of different colors and styles, but I really like this navy blue with this pink and gold and white print. So anyway, went with this one and I love the little tassel details. There's nothing that says summer like a little tassel. All right, I like this dress so much when I saw it online that I bought it in two colors. So I got it in this cute little leopard print and I also got it in this more of an olive green color. So it's the exact same dress, same cut, same maker. Um, this one comes in a lot of different colors and a lot of different patterns, but I really like this leopard. I don't know why I'm suddenly getting into leopard print, but it's just got a plain kind of a boat scoop neck, a little short cap sleeve. It's tapered through the bodice. It has a uh, gathered waist here. You just pull this one over your head. It's out of like stretchy um, jersey material. It's got a little tie belt here at the waist. And then it's got some elastic here, and then it goes down to this really pretty, really flattering tulip hem. I love the tulip hem on it. It's got a little bit of a slit, but it's not too high, and it's just such a flattering dress. I just think it's so pretty. I think I should put on a hat with it, definitely. This is definitely like a wear a hat with it dress to uh, finish up the outfit. This next dress is also super easy to throw on and wear. I tell you, that's the easy part about dresses for the summer is that you don't have to plan a whole outfit. You don't have to pick pieces that go together. You just pop on a dress and you are like out the door in five minutes. 
So I thought this one was so cute. This is another one that has an elastic waist and is a crisscross and you just throw it on. It's got a cute little flutter sleeve. I loved it in this orange with white polka dots. This one has a little tie belt as well. It has a ruffle edge here on the skirt and then it's got a higher slit in the front. The fabric is so lightweight and nice. This one also comes in a lot of different colors and uh, it's a great price point, very inexpensive. It's great for those super hot days of summer when you just wanna throw something on. You wanna look really put together, even though you might not be, you know, based on what's happening in your life, but you wanna look put together and you'll look so put together in this. I think this dress looks so cute with a denim jacket. You can pop on something like a distressed denim jacket or a little crop jacket of some kind, and then you'll be ready to go out for a more casual evening. All right, I've shown you this red dress a couple of times already, but I. I just love this thing so much. I hope that if you're looking for like that killer red dress for the summer, that this is the one that you'll get. I actually have found a couple of other dresses that were very similar to this at a lower price point, but I gotta say, they're not quite this dress. There's just something about this one, the fabric, the color, the neckline, it is just perfection, the drape. So anyway, this is definitely my favorite. It has been on sale for a long time for under $50, so it's a great price on it. So snap it up if you had wanted this dress. But let me just pop on the other one that's very similar to this. It has the same maxi skirt. Um, and it's just a little bit different. I think the main difference is that this comes in more sizes. So this one is an extra small, so it just fits me a little bit better. The lower priced one comes in more limited size range. So the smallest it has is a small, and I feel like it's just a little bit too big, but let me put it on and show you, and then we can do like a side by side to see the differences. So let me put this one over here. All right, and here's the other one. This one is $37. All right, guys, next up is bathing suits. <laughs> you guys ready? You guys got your beach bod ready? Well, I hope that you've got your uh, auto tan on, your self tanner. I'll link my favorite self tanner in the info box below because as you know, you should keep your skin out of the sun or at least slather on some good SPF while you're out there. But I feel like we all need a good bathing suit and oh my gosh, did I find a good one. Look at this guy, it is so cute and I love the one shoulder. But let's talk about the cover up first. This just caught my eye. I love the color scheme on this. I love this hot orangey red with this pink. I just think there's no fabric that I've seen that screams summer like this one does. I just love it. And it's so lightweight and floaty. This makes a great bathing suit cover up. You could also wear it just with like your denim cut off shorts and a white t-shirt and just drape this over. But let's talk about the bathing suit that I have on underneath. It is just an elegant, beautiful bathing suit. I love white for summer. I love this one shoulder, one strap detail with this ruffle. Then it's got this nice ruching across the belly, so it's gonna be a little bit uh, forgiving in the tummy area. The legs aren't cut too high. The bum isn't cut too high. It is like the perfect bathing suit. I usually will buy a medium in a one piece just because I have a super long torso, but this is a small and it fits perfectly. So I'd say that this is true to size. All right, this next bathing suit has got a lot of potential. Unfortunately, I think I bought it just a little bit too small. So what was I thinking? At like I just said, I usually buy a medium in bathing suits. I bought an extra small in this. <laughs> My torso is just way too long. So these straps are digging in on me, but I don't think it looks bad for an extra small. The problem is that the butt coverage just is not there. So I don't like that about it, but from the front, I love it. So I feel like I would wear this one and just not take my cover up off. Um, you know, so that would work for me. But I think that overall, it's a super cute bathing suit. It's got these little spaghetti straps. It's got um, not as good support in it as the white bathing suit did, but this one's pretty too. I am wearing it with my favorite cover up. I've had this one for a couple of years. This is just the best thing going on the beach. It's lightweight, it's fluffy, it um, just looks so cool. I love the little see-through crocheted parts here. I love the bell sleeve with a little bit of lace on it. 
It just gives me all the summer vibes and it just is the perfect little cover up. All right, so that is it for today's video, everybody. I hope you found it helpful and informative. I hope you enjoyed looking at the clothes that I had to show you today. If you're in the market for anything and liked anything you saw in the video, go ahead and hit up the links in the info box. As I mentioned before, all my sizing information will be down there to help you to choose what size you might want and all the links for quick and easy shopping. So I hope you guys are getting into the um, spirit of summer. It's getting nice and warm where I am. It's been beautiful the last couple of days. So these clothes are really just arriving right in time. So I'm so happy that I was able to do this video today. And so as always, I thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate your watching. Have a great day and I will see you in the next video. Take care everybody, bye-bye.